So in this little tutorial, I'm just going to show you uh, a pretty easy way to straighten up your decking boards when you're laying them. Oftentimes when you buy decking boards, they come in random lengths and they're also sometimes quite crooked and a little bit bent. Um, and the way that we lay them down nice and straight is by getting them into position correctly and uh, screwing them down nice and tight so they don't move. How do we move them and get them into position? Some of them can be very, very difficult, as you can see, <laughs> to get into position. I've got a good eight or nine millimeter gap here that I need to close up. So now I'm going to show you the best way to do this. Right. So just a quick overview of some of the tools that I'll be using to get this decking board straight today. Um, throughout the building of the deck, I like to keep my decking boards at an even spacing. So I have one piece of material. Um, some people use a nail, some people use a screw. I like to use a piece of metal angle. It's about 2.5 millimeters thick. Um, and you can put that metal angle in between your decking boards, sit it on top of a joist so there's still room underneath it. Um, so if it gets too tight, you can lever it out later on. Um, that being a consistent thickness also helps the look of your deck um, uh, so that your boards don't end up too far apart or too close together. Now, this other thing that I've made here is basically the same metal angle, but as you can see, I've ground down one of the edges just in case I do come across a, a time where um, I've had to close up one of the gaps. And as you can see, the angle doesn't fit. So this little uh, slimmer edge on, on this piece, if I ever come across that, will fit into the gap and it'll still hold. And it still serves the purpose of what we need to do. The other tool we're going to be using today is just a standard G clamp. Um, and, uh, and I'll show you now exactly how all these tools come together and straighten out a decking board. Okay, now as you can see, this decking board is um, its not too bad, but of course it's definitely not in the position that we want it. And given that the last screw was over here, it's going to be quite hard to hold that in by hand to screw it down. And it's going to be hard to get it accurate as well. I mean, if you were strong, you could probably pull it in and, and set a screw in there, but the chances are it won't end up in the right spot. So I'm going to get my piece of metal angle that I like to use to keep my decking boards nice and spaced out. Um, just a little tip on this one. This is a... Uh, 25 mil angle. So if you put this down on top of a joist, um, you'll find that you get a little bit of room to lever it out later on if it gets screwed in too tight. If you put it down here in the spacing between the joists, you'll have a lot of trouble getting your finger or getting a, a screwdriver or a chisel or something under there to actually get it out and you might damage your decking board. So I like to put this piece of angle on top of the joist um, and then we can pull the board in, clamp it in all we like and it'll easily come out and we'll be able to get something under it to pull it out. Now this little jig, uh, which I showed you before, is going to fit on the, on the, on the board before this one, so the, the previous board. And uh, the edge of this metal angle, as you can see, that goes a bit past your, uh, your piece of um, timber there, it just goes in the gap. Now, we're going to use the G-clamp straight over the top of that. As you can see, that board's in nice and um, firm against this piece of angle. You can, see, you can tell because it can only just be moved, so it's nice and tight. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to accurately measure out and screw, uh, drill, pre-drill my first hole. It's still nice and tight. Perfect. It comes off. They always spring back a little bit, but that's nothing to be worried about because I'd say that by the time yeah, it's still quite tight in there. So that's how we straighten our crooked decking board. 